what God revealed to Lorena a month ago. Prepare for the world's unbelievable changes. An urgent and profoundly alarming message reverberates through the very core of our world, originating directly from the Lord himself. The hour of divine judgment has now arrived. The righteous anger of God is poised to descend upon the earth, sweeping away every remnant of impurity and sin that has tainted our existence. Humanity, engulfed in the pervasive darkness of moral corruption and wickedness, stands at a critical juncture, facing a divine ultimatum, an immediate and heartfelt conversion or the prospect of eternal condemnation. There is no longer any room for delay or indecision. Repentance must be genuine and deeply transformative. The time for half-hearted apologies and superficial changes has passed. To withstand the relentless assaults of malevolent spirits that plague the world and seek to bring about the destruction of souls, it is imperative to purify your hearts thoroughly and fully embrace the illuminating light of faith. Only through such profound spiritual renewal can we hope to resist the forces of evil that threaten our very essence. Listen, inhabitants of the world. This is the last call because everything has begun, and my wrath will spread across the earth. Therefore, there is no time to put your life in order if there is no conversion. To survive the coming events, you must convert, but do so now and with sincerity. If your hearts are not pure and simple, evil will enter you, and you will not survive the attacks of the evil spirits that roam the world to tempt you. For this reason, you have been given the prayers of healing for your souls and hearts. It is late, repent with all your heart, and I will give you the grace to heal your hearts, provided with sincere willingness and conversion, and especially with heartfelt repentance. Bow your knees before the crucifix and ask for mercy and clemency, and I will forgive and heal your hearts and souls. Go to the sacrament of confession as soon as possible. Then. With a trusting and humbled heart before the crucifix, I will call for the radical and emphatic conversion of your life, giving me your fiat as a covenant between you and me. You must give a committed and sincere fiat, for I will consider you in the army of the Virgin Mary of Guadalupe, which is still awaiting its final soldiers. By joining this army, you will obtain great graces and gifts on the day of the illumination of consciences among you. Become living tabernacles and thus be protected by my seal of favor, protected by my seal of predilection from all the fatal events of your life. You will be shielded from all evil and brought into my presence so that, in a safe place outside this world, you will be preserved from all harm. God the Father, 